welcome. We're so glad you're here. We have a wonderful story to read to you today, and I think you're going to be very excited. <coughs> the story that I'm going to read is The Sea Cat Dreams, and it's written by J.R. Poulter and Musa <coughs> Ulazowski. And Musa sent me this book. And do you know where she lives? In Texas. In Texas? No, she lives in Australia. <coughs> Australia, is that far or very close to where we are here in Oregon? Far. Far. It's halfway around the world. <coughs> yes, Australia. And she is so excited about me reading this book to you. She said she loved this book. She's the illustrator. Do you know what an illustrator does? What does an illustrator do? I know, and you're gonna see some beautiful pictures as we go through the story. So, does anyone here have a cat? Whoa! A cat. Does anyone here have a Siamese cat? No. Oh my one. goodness. Well, maybe she thinks she does, huh? Well, a Siamese cat. This is a story of a little Siamese kitten. Okay, and it's called The Sea Cat Dreams. Can you say that? The, the Sea Cat, cat dreams. dreams. I didn't know cats could have dreams, did you? Well, let's see. Let's see what happens to this little kitty. The Sea Cat Dreams, written by J.R. Poulter, illustrated by Musa Ulazowski. So, here we go. I sit in the sun on the windowsill. Beyond the window, the sea, it waves its white fingers. Remember, remember, it murmurs to me. I love the taste of salt sea breath and sea surge distant moan. I was not born a sailor's cat. I am. Now I am grown. Oh, look at this. Born on a farm with a cherry tree where blossoms fluttered and flew. What color is this kitty's cat eyes? Blue. blue, beautiful blue eyes. I played with a pup and farmer's child. Together we romped and grew. What do you think that means, romped? Um, what do you think? We got bigger. Okay, but she's romping. So what does it look like she's doing? Run. Running. Romping is like running. Good job. So she grew up with a puppy and a little girl. I remember the noise of farmyard geese. Mm, how does a goose sound? Honk, 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 honk. Oh, yeah. Does a kitty look like she likes the noise of those geese? No, she's running. What's that other word for running? Romping, yeah, a romping. The shush of ducks curled in their feathers. You see the mama duck with how many little ones? How many? Four. 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 You see four? I see four. I can't really see. I see five. Oh, I, I think there's five four. little I ducklings. Five. So this is a kitty running. I recall the raven on the wall. Wow, look at that raven. Do you know another word for raven? Mm -mm. Um, a blackbird? I yeah, can't. you're right, a blackbird. <coughs> a blackbird. And the butterflies dance together. Look at those butterflies dancing. Oh my goodness, I feel like getting up and dancing too. Then came a traveler with a haversack who smelled of herring fish. He stayed a night by the firelight. So this guy came to visit the house and he had a haversack. What, what could we say another <coughs> word for haversack would be? Bag. Yeah, bag, good. Maybe even backpack, right? <coughs> okay. 
and he smelled <laughs> of herring fish. So if he smelled like fish, would the kitty cat like him? No. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Kitty cats love fish, don't they? Mm, okay. Yes. And this man stayed for a night, and he <clears throat> left with a heave and a swish. So he was there one night, and then he was gone. I snuggled deep in his salty sack. Oh, where did the kitty go? He went with him. Yeah. Do you think the guy wanted him to go at first? No. Did he know? Yeah. No. He no. just got in there. Adrift with dreams of sea, not till his sack was stowed aboard did the sailor man find me. Oh, my goodness. He was stow it stowed aboard. What does that mean? Like he got aboard. Well, he was there, right? And if we stow his sack, what does that mean? Storage. Store it. Yeah, we put it on the ship and look at them. How would you look if you found a kitty cat in your book bag? Oh, oh my I goodness! Would be excited. You would be excited. Yeah. I would keep <laughs> mine. Good for I you. Keep mine. Well, let's I see. Like that too. Let's see what happens to this kitty cat, sailor, cook, and captain. All welcomed me as crew. I chased the rats in the cargo hold that earned me all my due. And so he didn't pay for his ticket on the ship. So what did he have to do to pay for his way? He had to work. He has to work. And what does the kitty cat do to work? Eat fish. <coughs> huh? Chase the rats away. There you go. He chases all the rats away, and that's a good thing. I sat on the deck while dolphins played, skimming and racing beside. A leap and a splash. They were gone in a flash, where the ocean <coughs> rolls deep and wide. There came a storm, and my sailor was swept from deck to sea, they searched for days in its vastness. Oh my goodness, what happened to that little sailor that he stowed in his sack? Um, he fell into the he, sea. He fell overboard, oh my goodness. Then I meowed his eulogy. How does a kitty meow? Meow, meow, meow. Because he was really sad that his friend was lost. Look at that kitty. Oh my goodness. They gave me to his grieving wife in her cottage alone on the shore. I'm a comfort to her and she cares for me. What could I ask for more? So the kitty can't be on the ship anymore. So they gave it to that man's wife. Isn't that nice? And does the lady, you think she's happy to have that kitty? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's happy to have that kitty. Now I curl under wind-swept curtains to the whisper of waves and foam. <clears throat> I dream of the sea, the dolphins, the man. I wake to the salt scent of home. So, wow, this kitty cat had lots of changes in his life, didn't he? Mm -hmm. He lived in lots of places. He lived in a lot of places. There she goes. First was a what? <laughs> A farm. farm and then a farm. boat and then a house. house. And is it and do you think the kitty is happy? Yes. Yeah. Have you ever had to change like move to a new house? No. Raise your hand if you've ever had to move to a new house. Oh a my lot. a lot. Okay. How many of you've ever had to go to a new school? Yeah. Well my sister's gone to Okay, okay. How did it feel going to a new house or a new school? Fun. It was fun? Good for yeah, you. Yeah, I like my new and, But when I was a big guy, I moved to a different house. Okay. How did it feel to you, sweetie? Um, I felt kind of scared. Yeah, sometimes. But we, if we have change in our lives, we can think about the beautiful sea cat, right? And how happy he was no matter where he was, right? Yeah, so that was a good story. So the next time you have change, think about it with a happy face, right? It's an adventure. You can have an adventure like the sea cat, right? 
Okay, thank you for coming. We hope you enjoyed our story. And until next time, can you say, I am safe? I am safe. I am loved. I am loved. I am good. I am good. Thank you. Thank you.